Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well and welcome back. Let's play some more of our Grand Pirate Confederacy of Japan, the Wokou. 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 I'm never going to say it right. So anyways, welcome back. Let's play some more. And uh, we got plenty to do. Uh, first and foremost, I need to state up a bunch of land that I had not done because this is all free states. It's literally free real estate. Do I want to state up Hokkaido? Probably. It's gonna cost us some extra abna, but it's all good. It's all good in the hood. Um, are we gonna take tech? Nope. All right, we need to take mill tech though, and I need to take diplo tech so I'm not falling behind. And then after we take mill tech, we can focus down our uh, our mill thing. Um, and so, hmm. Let's go ahead and focus mill. It's fine. Uh, so we are at war with. You and Korea. Did they attack me? No. Blockade ports. Okay, well, I can do that. So let's go ahead. Hmm. Right. So we can have a lot more ships here. So let's go ahead and have that be a thing. So let's go ahead and build lots more galleys. And then we'll build a few more lights for down here eventually. I'm not too concerned about them right now. So, as far as their army, I could totally land men over here, and I will do that. So let's go ahead and bring you guys back. Get you over there. It's a bummer that they're not dropping off my, uh... Yeah, I don't agree with that. They should be dropping off the dude with my general. That's, uh, certainly the correct way to do that. So let's go ahead and have you guys come out there. Tolerance of heretics? I would rather convert them, honestly. There we go. I think we'll just wait on tech so we don't fall behind. Um, war score cost versus other religions. If I'm correct, I think that actually means like war. So it's only 7.5 war score to take war reps. If I'm correct, I might be wrong on that. Okay, cool. Well, we can totally blockade this guy easy enough. They can seize that down. I don't care. I mean, what's going to happen? We're going to get some rebels down there? Maybe. Not a big deal. Let me see here. Not bad. One of my coworkers texted me. Very good. How's everybody's mill tech looking compared to mine? 12, 11, 10. So... Korea actually has a tactics advantage on me, so I need to be aware of that. And, uh, ooh, a water shortage. Very good. So, do we have any more cannons? We definitely need more cannons. So we can certainly afford them. So let's go ahead and get a few more. What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, that sounds good to me. Let's take that so we are not paying extra money for... Uh, for that, that'll actually, basically, that will pay for the extra um, men that we're bringing into the field here. We'll actually be able to get a maximum amount of siege benefit on here, so we'll be able to take down his capital. Which appears he's got some rebels over here, so... I'm not too concerned about that. So let's come on up to Pyongyang. And then we'll just need to blockade him and it'll be fine. Like, we're, we literally don't have to worry about anything. Hey, those rebels are probably going to come. It's weird that they don't have a logo, though. Let's go ahead and have you guys brought over there. Ah, I should have had them come over into this Grasslands province. It's all good. Just a couple of extra days. Let's have you guys over here. Let's go ahead and do it. I have my colonist over here. And we've already... Finished off those natives over there, so we are golden. The Rossids have gone bankrupt. Where are the Rossids? Don't feel like I've ever heard of that one. I might be making that up. I probably haven't heard about heard of them, but so we are at what? Plus three on that one. So let's go ahead and get some men off there, so we're not taking a bunch of attrition. They can go on down there. Um, not really a big deal. 
Uh, Mino or half off mill guy. Sounds good to me. Totally. Yeah, well, that's worth. So, yeah, no, we don't want to do that. I was going to say, we want to come up into the mountains and see if we can bait them into a good fight. Oh, their navy just got killed. Ooh, we stole their heavy. I like that. We stole their heavy, three galleys, and five lights. Goodness gracious. I don't want them, though. Didn't we just build up the force limit, basically? We'll get it sorted out. Hmm. Just high income. Two inflation for admin points. Yeah, unfortunately, I, I need to get my inflation down. So I suppose getting inflation down is more important than humanist. We're actually not having any unrest currently, so we're good to go. All right, so let's get these guys down here. Let's see if we can catch these guys over here. No, we should probably not give them the out there. So what's this terrain look like down here? So here we go. Severely outnumbered. Somehow they're... Whoa, hold on. Really? Okay. Let's, uh... Let's just act like that didn't just happen, because that's kind of bogus, but, uh... Okay! <laughs> I'm gonna call bullcrap on that one, but that's all good. It's whatever. They have 0.25, um... What's it called on me? Apparently that's, uh, good enough to justify them beating me like that, but that's fine. Uh, their tactics. Morale of navies is fine. This is actually Wu. We have a miltech advantage on him, so he just... He's gonna lose that. Okay. win these forts here. Now, ideally, he... Ah, he did win it. Feels bad, man. Alright, let's get up here, then. How are you so much faster than me, dude? You have one maneuver! This is infuriating. Absolutely infuriating. Let me just reinforce them. Have them free, flee up there. Ah, you're annoying. Alright. I cannot believe how much they're just stomping me right there. That does not seem right, but it's all good. I'll actually be the defender over here, which is really good. Um, just kidding, it's not very good. So let's actually... Mm, yeah, we don't want this. Um, somehow he has high enthusiasm, which is really strange because he was just on low a moment ago. So that's, uh, that does not seem right, but that's okay. Okay, let's get everybody up here just in case we need to flee. I think it's probably in my best interest to like get these guys all grouped up let's go ahead and just pull these these troops out and have them go home and repair and then we'll just blockade the crap out of them and while his capital is just destroyed and he, there's nothing he can do about it there we go let's go ahead and have you guys blockade enemy ports there we go yeah, yeah, never mind. I don't want you to blockade that port. <laughs> it literally does not make any sense. So let's go ahead, do something like this. Do something like that, that's fine. Just blockade a bunch of their ports. Ming looking bad. Looking like they're getting beat up on. Rest in peace, Ming Ming. Those guys just got stack wiped, which is good. 
So keys up here. When can we raid? 56. So they're actually killing off rebels, which is great for me. Let's come on down here, siege them out. Or not siege them out, but uh... Oh, our admiral died? Feels bad. Let's actually have you guys go ahead and hunt pirates in uh... Not hunt pirates. Privateer in Malacca. There we go. So they don't have any ships over here that I need to worry about. So let's go ahead and have you guys come over here. Ooh. There we go. Let's go ahead and have you guys head home and repair up. That probably makes more sense then. Alright. So I want war reps and then all of your money. And I also want you to break your alliance with him. I don't want any of his land. I mean, maybe this island there, but I don't care about that one. It's fine. Let's say we hate Wu. Can we go to war with Wu? Totally. If we could get some trade power over here, we totally could. So let's go ahead and grab these guys, and then... Let's go ahead and take these guys and these guys, and have them group up. And then we'll have everybody else group up. And group up in like, was this Seishu? I'm not sure if this is actually a Japanese island today or not. I'm not familiar. So now we're losing a bunch of money again. Um, yeah. Definitely gonna need Miltech. Woo's on 11, I'm on 11. So let's have those guys grouped up. These guys grouped up now. Have them protecting trade over here in uh, Hangzhou. Oh, we can't? But uh, we totally can. We 100% we can. So let's go ahead and go do that now. Because I don't know why it says we can't. There's literally no reason why we shouldn't, but... Let's have you guys, okay. Let's have you and you with him protecting trade in, excuse me, why? Why are you not able to protect trade here? I literally have land in this trade node almost. Excuse me? This is so not right. I'm very confused. Very genuinely confused. Let's go ahead and transfer from here instead of Jiren and see if that means, like, if that gives us the ability to protect there. Okay, that's weird. Basically, we just need some spy network here. As far as where we actually want to attack next, Something down here would be good, because we can totally just land men here. Take this, and we're good to go. We'll actually be able to get a miltech advantage on them. So that's going to be in the works here. And we just need to wait until we have 10. Totally. So we just need 10 spy network, and we'll be able to get that war score, or that war, um, war opportunity. The CB. <gasps> Excuse me, goodness. A little hiccup there. Okay. Now that he's my, uh... Hey, gold. Gold in Iwami. Oh, lose the money. Screw that. I'm not losing that. Where's Iwami? Iwami. There we go. Very good. We're a little behind on tech, but uh... More money is better. More money is good money. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, justify trade conflict. Um... 
Let me see here. I'm really building spy network in, in Ming. I'm so annoyed. All right, Ming. <laughs> hey, cool. Free population in the Andamans. Let's go ahead and recall this guy, or I guess we can just let him go. And then we can actually core up something over here. Oh, oh, they're sending somebody there. Who's this? Colonist is traveling from Japan. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Right there. Beautiful. That actually means that we can... After we justify this trade conflict, we can have you guys head on over and privateer in Bengal. We will actually make a lot more money over here than we were... No, that's not true. We want to protect privateer in Malacca. That's going to give us the best bang for buck, probably. And um, I'm thinking probably declaring on Wu is in our best interest. Because you will join and we'll be able to... I mean, realistically, we could even separate piece him if we really wanted to. Um, so let's see here. Cannons. Manpower is probably good. So they already have about 25. So they're at 23. So let's have you guys brought over there. We only have two navies now, which is good. All right. Let's go ahead and attack this guy here for a trade dispute, which is blockade of ports. Probably actually should have had him give me his trade power as well. That's a misplay, but it's okay. Let's go ahead and take banner infantry, apparently. And then uh, go with the defensive guys. So we're going to have these guys head on out here. Blockade. I mean, that's long story short. That's all you really have to do. I'm not seeing any of his navies anywhere. They have 28 galleys somewhere. Wu has 28 galleys. That's pretty crazy, actually. Let's go ahead and do the good old Scorched Earth trick and see if we can bait them in there. Go ahead and have those guys head home so we can try to get a good old blockade trick. Ooh. Korchin is the Emperor. Uh, that won't last. That certainly won't last. Alright, you. Come on in. Catch these hands, boy. Mm-hmm. We have pretty low Republican tradition. No wonder. We need to get these Buccaneers in charge for Republican tradition. So let's go ahead and do that, and we're just going to spend some points to get them in charge. And uh, I'm actually just going to go ahead and start pushing through it. There's no reason not to. We're going to fall behind on this tech. It's it's whatever. I just need to let it happen. And so through blockading them, we're going to be gaining winning battles. Show superiority. Really? I must have misread the uh, I misread the thing. Well, that's fine. We have superior numbers, or at least even numbers. So let's go ahead and get a general. Get him over there. Get you out there. All right. And now we just need to wait it out. Siege down some stuff. We can separate piece him out. Canton is his capital, so and it's farmland, so. We're good. It's blockaded, so it'll be an easy siege. We just beat them up, kick them out, and we're good to go. You know, that's all it takes. Yu is just at war with me, so that's good. Looks like Shun is actually kind of not doing so good with Kin or Kin, Kin. I don't know how to pronounce any of those. Broken free, little breakaway state. Ming has gone bankrupt, which is no good. Which is no surprise, judging by the amount of separatists and all that garbage that's got going on over there. I don't care about Roman fever. We won the Siege of Canton. Let's go ahead and do a quick little carpet siege over here and see if we can uh, actually get some get some good changes out of him. Let's go ahead and get you guys over here. Let's have our Grand Admiral out here. Totally. Oh, we're going to end up stealing a bunch of those. Yeah, three trades and a galley. So 
so we're gonna peace out you. Uh huh. Um, I'll take the prestige. That's good. Somebody's got some men somewhere in the field. I don't know where they are, but they're there somewhere. All right. So let's go ahead and siege everything down over here. Let's get our guys out of his territory. There we go. Transfer trade power, all your money. I guess not a transfer trade power. I don't know. What am I doing over here? Am I transferring and what in the world? What am I doing? I'm collecting down here? Okay, yeah, I messed something up somewhere along the lines. Um Let's come on over here and blockade him real quick, see if that'll give us a little bit of extra oomph to uh negotiate. I guess I'd probably rather No, that's not true. I'd rather him break his alliances. There we go. There we go. Let's have those guys head up here. They have no galleys of over here. One transport, so we're good. Let's go ahead and put our generals already there. We want to make sure that our, our main fleet is... Uh, in good shape, right? And so we are getting lots of money from privateering down there. Almost seven a month. Wow. No, actually only three from three. Ah, yes. Okay. That makes more sense. Loot. <laughs> All right. So let's see here. Um, oh, he took some land from Ming. Took a big bite out of him, actually. Those capitals up here in this Hangzhou. We'll take that as soon as we finish this one up. Let's go ahead and make sure we got all of our cannons over there. All of our horses up here. No need to take attrition for things that don't matter. There we go. Hmm. I probably should just start uh, working my way through these this mill ideas because this is going to end up giving us each of these ideas gives us a minus two percent um tech and then this will actually give us five so it's going to be two four six eight thirteen percent cheaper tech if i just go ahead and fall behind for a little bit so i think i should do that oh goodness oh goodness this might be bad for me let's actually have you guys come on over here see if we can bait a good fight for us there we go let's burn that land this is my land boy there we go. Let's actually just see if we can bait it. We want them to attack us big time. Um, naval force limit for sure. Keep them coming. Come on now, attack me, you turds. Attack me, bro. Don't tase me, bro. 15th of October. All right, cool. Let's do this. So it'll be there on the 7th. Oh, we'll be there way before them. This is great. Scorched Earth is so good. I love it. He does have a superior general, but we have superior mill tactics as well as morale. So yeah, that's no problem. We might actually be able to catch them. Where are they going? Over here, probably. Yeah, they are. Good. Is that a stack wipe? No, probably not. Oh, it was. Ooh, okay. Well, that's certainly enough to do whatever we want, but we're gonna want 100% them, so might as well, right? When in Rome, isn't that the saying? So let's go ahead and do that. All right, let's have you guys split, split, split. There we go. Have you guys split, split, split. Go kill off some of them. And uh, there we go. Now we just need to siege them down and we're good to go. This is crazy. This is going so well, actually. There we go. And they're just sieging stuff down down there. There we 
go. Let's get you guys down there. I don't care about Navy tradition. Oh, they're killing my men. All right, we have key in here. I forgot about them. <laughs> well, that's fine. Let's go ahead and uh, get this guy over here. So they're going to attack me, but uh, we should be able to flee. Oh, no. This army got stack wiped. Oh, no. That's really bad, actually. I did not even realize that those rebels had just popped and killed both of my army stacks there. That is so bad. Oh, that is a damn shame, man. That makes me really sad, actually. Now, let's kill their navy. Seven galleys and three lights. And we still, we're gaining. Like, this is... Oh, this is so good. Okay. Well, maybe we don't need to have them... Definitely want to humiliate them, because we want to make sure we're keeping a big PP. So I'll just take what I can from them instead. Oof. Yeah, that's quite the quite the defeat there. So we lost all of our cav, a bunch of our cannons, and a few men. So let's have you guys grouped up. We're actually just demolishing everybody around us. Nobody even stands a chance. Um, tributary trading port. Province, this province is experiencing economic growth due to being the home port of a local tributary fleets. Until two years from now. Yeah, no bueno. Uh, let's also figure out my trade. I don't know what's going on here. So let's go ahead and transfer from here and collect from here. That's probably going to bring me more money in, right? 12.03 up to what? Yeah, 14. Definitely better. Oh, no way. Making a lot of money right now. All right, cool. Let's get you guys up home. Next war is going to be a war. Another war episode. Next episode is going to be another war episode. We're going to be going to war with Malacca down here. He's got a nice little hug box here, but all we need to do is land on here. Take Bintan, which is uh, Singapore, I believe. And... Uh, should be fine we'll just you know we'll take it it's ours and they can't do anything about it so hope you guys are excited to see that and if you are please show your support and leave a like and subscribe if you have not already let's go ahead and go up to 10 cannons and if you would like to uh check out the discord or support the channel via our patreon page the links for that is going to be in the description below the video and with all of that being said this is chewy shoot and i'll catch you guys later a big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yodaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.